Neighbors in an uptown Dallas neighborhood are celebrating after plans for a controversial Sam's Club have now been scrapped. This is a battle they began waging years ago. CBS 11's Brooke Rogers live for us with the details on how they won. Brooke? Well, Doug, these 17 acres of land will remain vacant for now. One thing we know will not be here is a Sam's Club. Neighbors near Uptown Dallas's City Place say the city promised them a vibrant, walkable community here, a companion to the nearby West Village, not big box retail. So when it came to light that actually that's what was going to be developed, uh, my neighbors and I felt like there'd been a bait and switch. Moore says the city and developer Trammell Crow Company misled them and changed the zoning without notifying them. It has nothing to do with the Sam's Club. It's more like the promise that's being delivered. So they waged protests, made t shirts and buttons, and started a petition that garnered nearly 3,000 signatures. A district court judge has now ruled that neighbors were not given adequate notice and voided the part of the ordinance that made room for Sam's Club. We we're absolutely ecstatic. I mean, this. This is something that we were told from the beginning was impossible and a, a fight that we couldn't win. Dallas City Council member Adam Madrano calls it a great victory for the neighborhood and says the grassroots effort was key. The developer can still build a wide range of mixed use facilities, and a spokesperson says, We are encouraged that the court ruled in our favor to maintain our zoning, and we will take this opportunity to work with the city and neighbors to deliver a well rounded retail community. Neighbors hope that's a precedent that continues beyond the city limits. All we've ever wanted is to be able to participate and have a seat at the table to have our voices heard. And either side can appeal, but I'm told that's unlikely here. We did reach out to Sam's Club for comment, but have not heard back. Live in Dallas, Brooke Rogers, CBS 11 News.